In this video, we'll talk about how ABB devices communicate and are controlled on a network using IEEE 1722 AVDEC protocols. 1722 is a unique way that ABB devices communicate their abilities to the ABB components on a network. AVDEC is short for Audio, Video, Discovery, Enumeration, Connection, and Control. But let's break this into its parts. AVDEC Discovery is how ABB devices advertise itself to the network. I'm an ABB talker or listener, or I support network redundancy. This also allows discovery by ABB controller software. AVDEC Enumeration and Control defines what an ABB device supports, and it advertises the support to the ABB switch, which in turn advertises this to any ABB-capable device. This can include, but is not limited to, user settable labeling names, channel limits and sampling rate, any support for internal DSP chains like mutes or level controls, any internal processing latency of the device, an advertisement of physical jack types like XLR or RCA or HDMI, security support, diagnostic information such as air counters, packet delivery counters, and clocking status counters. AVDEC connection details how an AVB device sets up a connection to another device. This is the protocol that an AVB controller uses to establish the actual connection. These controllers include audio science controllers or read controllers. So what does this mean to you? Most media network transfers involve proprietary communications to advertise themselves to other devices on the network. Typically, these don't include all the parameters that AVB encompasses. Some transfer definitions don't even support methods of advertisement. This can be seen in the AES67 transport definition. 1722 is an IEEE standard that is available for anyone to openly use. Not only can it deliver more information, it's readily available to any manufacturer to implement. In the next video of this series, we'll discuss AVB's ability to reserve bandwidth on a network for media streams. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more insights, tutorials, and answers to frequently asked questions.